Hello everyone, it's Kelsey here. Welcome and welcome back to my channel, Budget Better Life, where I budget, cash stuff, and save for a less stressful, more enjoyable life. And if that sounds great and you can relate, then keep watching. Okay guys, so let's get this money out and we'll get right into it. Um, as you guys can see, I've kind of shifted things around here. Hope that works out for today. Um, I did get a new cash tray, so I'm very excited about that. Um, so let's count this money and get it all set up. One, two, three, four, five, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 80, 97, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. So seven, 28 today and I only have 728 because right now I'm just going to stuff the bills binder. Um, I have a big plan for the um, sinking funds to stuff my sinking funds and to stuff my savings. So in the next video you see, I will be stuffing sinking and savings. Um, so let me just take a look in the camera really quick and make sure that you guys can see this money and that everything looks okay. Yeah, you can. Okay, so I, I really liked this one a lot better because I felt like the other one, you're just seeing the tops of the money and this way it kind of lays and you can see all the bills since I am filming from like this angle. So I think this is gonna be great. So um, let me grab my wallet so that we can, I said we're just stuffing bills, but what I meant is we're just stuffing bills and my spending wallet. So let me get these out and pull all these receipts out. Okay guys, so this is what we have for rollover for this week, 20, 40, 45, 50, 51, 52, 53. And I'm just gonna set this off to the side. I will stuff it in my savings challenges in the next video. And the only envelope that still has some money in it is household, but we're just gonna add to that. So groceries this week is getting 100 and we'll do a $100 bill. I think the face is out, so I'll put him this way. And I'm only doing 100 because we are really stocked up on stuff right now. So I think that should be okay for the week. Um, snacks is going to be getting 40, so I will do 20, 40 for snacks and I am hoping to go to BJ's again maybe not this week that's why I left the 50 in here um, we're gonna do another 50 in household but maybe next week hmm, or a few weeks but hopefully soon we can go to BJ's again and stock up on snacks that has actually been really helpful in keeping those these spending categories a little bit lower so that's working out. Um, pet food, we are all good. We bought in bulk, so we're good there. Beauty is not getting anything this week. Fun is going to be getting a 50. So 50 and fun. And this is just if we get some takeout or maybe we'll go out to eat with a friend or something like that. Um, or if we're, if we want to go like do a little shopping or something like that, that's pretty much what I use fun for miscellaneous. I'm not going to stuff this week because I feel like we have been having a good amount of rollover. So that should be set for these spending categories. All right, guys, let's get into this bill binder. So here is the bills binder. And I have some scratch marks here. Don't worry about those. I'm just trying to figure out if I need to like adjust these at all. Um, but I will continue with the 113 since that's what I've been doing. So we'll do 1, 10, 11, 12, 13. So rent is going to be getting 1, 10, 11, 12, 13. And we'll add that here. And since it is the last week of the month, we will be pulling these bills very soon and probably actually tomorrow morning um, and going to the bank, since it will be a Saturday, I will wanna hit the bank um, while they open. I, they do have Saturday hours, but I know that they're shorter. So I'll make sure to go to the bank first thing in the morning. Um, so rent has one, two, three, four, 
10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52. And these $2 are extra. So I'm going to pull them out right now and put them aside for my savings challenges. So really rent is um, $4.50, but I wanted to break it down so I was evenly putting a, the same amount in every week. So that's how I had done it. And I stuck these trackers in here. I don't know if I will um, track the, the bills, but I was thinking that I might want to try doing that. So I stuck those in there. We'll see how that goes. Kia this week is getting $1.75, so we'll do $1.50. 75 150 75 we'll add that here so kia now has one two three four five 6, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 700 dollars. So that is correct. And I saw this 10 was just flipped around. Um, so 700 for Kia, that is a hefty car payment. Um, we are working on fixing our credit right now, um, paying down credit cards and all of that. If you watch my other videos, um, my I will be doing another debt update soon. Um, so hopefully once we get, oh, I can't leave it like that. <laughs> once we get our credit in a better um, position, we'll be able to refinance this loan and hopefully get the payment lower. AT&T is going to get 50. Easy enough. And AT&T should have 200. 51, 52. Perfect. So I'll make sure to pull these all in the morning. I don't know if you guys want to see me unstuff this bills binder when I pay my bills. If that's something you guys are interested in or not. Um, 25 will be going to Progressive. And this will not be getting unstuffed. I might think about condensing this. Um, because maybe I'll condense it when I pull my bills tomorrow to go to the bank because this will stay in here for six months. So Progressive now has 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. That is perfect. These keep wanting to flip. Okay, that's good. So let's see, the next category is storage and storage is getting 32, so 20, Oh, sorry, I'm probably not on camera when I'm pulling that. 20, 30, 1, and 2. All right, I have to be like, this is such a long tray. So I'm like aware of like where, because of how I set the camera up, like what is in the shot and what isn't in the shot. So trying to be mindful of that, but um, it's not easy when you're filming at this angle but I will surely get the hang of it here, guys. I feel like you guys have been so sweet in the comments section, just telling me that I'm doing such a great job and just kind of cheering me on. Um, this community has been so amazing, so I'm very grateful and thankful to all of you guys. So storage now has 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. And I do feel like, because I did the 32, that might be a little bit extra. Um, I think it might only be 125 for the storage. I'd have to check. But if it is, I'll just take the ones again and probably put them towards my savings challenges. Since I've been really obsessed with savings challenges, guys, I feel like the whole reason I got into cash stuffing is because I see you guys do the savings challenges and they just look like so much fun. I seriously want to buy like every single savings challenge that is out there and I've had to like reel it in a little bit but um I'm very excited to do that next video um so we'll keep moving here subscriptions is going to get 23 so we've got oops so we've got 20 and this should be the last one two and three yes it is 23 for subscriptions and this one is probably um one that's going to need to go up but when I adjust the number, I will kind of fill you guys in on all of that, I think. 
So right now subscriptions has 20, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46. So that is fine. And there we go. And that's all set. Credit cards, um, I'm bumping this one up to 70 just because I feel like making it a more even number. Any little extra that can go towards the credit card payments, I'm fine with. So we're going to do 70. So 20, 40, 60, and 70 is going to go to credit cards. So let's see what we have. Okay, so now in credit cards, we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 180, 90, 95, 96, 97, 197. Hopefully I did that right. If I didn't, someone can tell me in the comments, but I <laughs> tried my best. So we will deposit that and make those payments tomorrow. And then miscellaneous is just for my receipts. So that is it. Um, I have stuffed everything for my spending this week and my bills. Um, very excited. This is my first month that I have completed um, cash stuffing um, and used this method. And um, I really thought it was important for me to do the bills because I have a tendency to like not save the money for the bills and just be like oh I have to pay this and it's like a big chunk coming out whereas if I'm able to do it like this and save a little bit each week it feels a lot more manageable and like I still have money for groceries I still have money for all the spending and I still have money to save and put into the sinkings funds so I feel like this has been really helpful um, I know a lot of you guys don't stuff your bills, but um, I wanted to try it this way. And since I have completed a month doing it this way, I think I will stick with it. I really enjoyed it. Um, and yeah, guys, that is going to be it. A little bit of a short video today. But again, I'm going to be coming out with another video very soon where I am stuffing sinking funds and I am doing a lot of savings challenges. So make sure you're subscribed so you guys don't miss any videos and make sure to catch that next video. But that is it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.